Hello, my beautiful Capricorn dragons. Welcome to your little love reading for December, January, or whenever this video happens to pop up and you click on it. So let's go ahead. Um, wow, singles. We're going into Capricorn singles, okay, guys? So right away, um, I want to say, just if this isn't your story, don't make it your story. Okay, go find one of your other signs. Um and and see if um, if something another sign sort of suits you. I know sometimes when I'm listening to readings to like, well, this isn't me, and then all of a sudden a few days later I'll be like, oh. <laughs> so okay, this is too many coming out. Too many. Okay, so it's supposed to be so Capricorn singles. Okay, so um I feel that, here we go. So you, um, you were dating and I feel like you're in a new phase in your life. So you went through something already where, um, you've already been through something else in back. So you're meeting somebody new, right? You're, um, I'm really hearing that you have to be careful with the person because I feel like they're going to appear one way and they're going to be a different way. This is not for everybody, okay? Um, don't make this about if it's not for you, okay? So um, you have somebody in your life that you may be dating that is um, self-absorbed, okay? They... Um, it's a one-sided relationship and they may be love bombing you because look at this, I have soulmates and then the ax. So what happens is in certain relationships, people will come in and they, they actually mirror you. Okay. They actually mirror what you want. And then all of a sudden they slowly start to sort of hammer at you and then they become your worst nightmare and they make you think that you're like their soulmate. They'll say yes to everything that you are and slowly they'll start tearing that away from you. And, um, and then look at this because you have soulmates acts, right? So this is about stopping the pattern. They might also silent treatment you and you need to stop that fast before it comes into your energy too much. This might also be um, what you went through right? Um, but I'm hearing that it's somebody that you might start to date. So just watch the energy. Okay. Watch the energy. Can I get a card on this? Don't forget guys to right now, if you're in the Northern hemisphere, yeah, if you're in the Northern hemisphere, um, right now we have going on what's called the cuffing season. It's where people just try to get together. So they're not alone during the dark days. Yeah, so look at this. We have forgiving and learning and getting to know each other. I'm not seeing these in a good light. I'm seeing that you have somebody that keeps, uh, they keep going, oh, come on, forgive me, forgive me. And then they go back and do it again. And I think that you're really getting to know them. I actually don't think that this is actually a good relationship because you have, uh, you, you have this ax, okay, with this. And it's this golden mirror they are pretending to be your soulmate, but they are not. So just if something feels off, okay, you need to go and investigate it. Look up the red flags in relationships. There's a thousands of millions of videos for free that you can watch on YouTube about this. What is a good relationship? What is a bad relationship? What are the signs of a possible narcissistic relationship, right? If you have a gut feeling and it's bad, yeah, look at this separation. Okay. Um, it is not, uh, it, it's not good. Okay. If, if you have a gut feeling, you need to go with your gut. Cause normally when we go against our gut is when we regret it the most. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So this was a past life relationship and you might've known them before, but it doesn't mean that you should be with them. You weren't with them when then you're not going to be with them now. Okay. So Capricorn singles, that's just, that's, 
that's that okay guys so um if that's not for you then please like this is the thing with general readings okay guys is it's at your discretion to realize when things are for you and aren't it's funny because I just split the cards and I need to point this out too because I never look when I split and I saw this coffin. Endings bring new beginnings, okay? This needs to be ending, okay? That's still in that energy, okay? Yeah, okay, Cap Capricorn couples. Actual proper coupling relationship energy, hopefully. Let's see what comes through. want to see <laughs> okay so let's see <laughs> you guys are like running to the altar you guys are like trying to run ahead with something um you know what i'm hearing i'm hearing a very specific story for some of you it's like so you have an abundance you have wedding rings rings and you have the runner i'm not seeing the runner is what it's meant to be i'm hearing that the runner is it's like that's that we've waited through covid we've waited through all of this quickly Let's go before this whole new variant kicks in. Let's go get married quick. So that's really what I'm hearing with this, right? It is, it's a soul connection, right? And it's about keeping a positive mindset and also manifesting exactly what you want, right? I'm not hearing that the runner, it's not like that. Nobody's going to be leaving. I'm not hearing that at all. I'm hearing that you both are racing to try to get this in. Well, you can have a proper celebration, okay? Uh... <laughs> Or you're trying to be, uh, trying to make a connection somehow. So maybe even if you're just committed, say you have a long distance relationship and you guys are actually trying to like maybe run and have travel plans together while well, you can before who knows what's going to happen, right? Who knows? But it's, um, I know where I live, our numbers are going up again. So who knows? Who knows, guys? Okay, so yeah sunglasses so i feel like you're just sort of watching and trying to see what's happening and going on right so you guys are just maybe you're wearing sunglasses maybe you guys have gone away right um maybe you guys have sort of gone away at the bottom here so let me see because i put these cards at the bottom is lightning so it's like sudden change so something's happening fast right so it's like i just hear that you guys are really just trying to get this over not over with like in a bad thing it's just like quick 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 it's like um, it's like playing a video game, right? And you, you have to wait until the perfect time to like bolt through so you don't get uh, taken out. So I feel like you guys are really just trying to uh, <laughs> to do this in a way that, you know, that it actually happens because it's you've been waiting for this for a while. Just been trying to do something. Okay, so I'm taking these. Let's see what's come out for you. So let go of control issues. That's kind of funny considering the reading, right? So it's like you guys are trying to force it so much, right? And calling in your soulmate. I feel like, so what it is, is like, I think that it's just asking you to reconnect with your partner, right? It's like, listen, okay, I know that we've been trying to force this and force this and force this to happen. And it's like, you know what, at least we're still together. And, um, and, and I think it's just asking you to see your abundance, okay? So keep that positive mindset and you will manifest exactly what you want, okay? So you're gonna, you guys are gonna get there, okay? So um, Capricorn, this is actually a really lovely reading. Thank you very much for this, by the way. Please like and subscribe. I appreciate your support for my channel as always. And I will see you in my next reading. Thank you so much, guys. Love you. Bye.